Hi there, folks. It's Jonathan Denwood here from WP Tonic. And in this video, I'm going to be comparing Zoom with Whereby. Uh, a new platform might be a new platform to you. And we're we'll comparing the two together. Which one's best for a coach or somebody setting up a membership website? I think you're going to find it interesting. Got some observations. Use both. I'm sure you're going to find this video useful. I'll be back in a few moments, folks. Coming back. So um, I'm comparing Zoom with Whereby. Um, so a bit of background. Zoom obviously has become almost a verb. Over COVID days, everybody was Zooming. Um, became really popular. Um, people got fed up with Zoom. Um, but for coaches, for those running membership websites that want to, that combine one-to-one -one or group coaching sessions, it's a powerful tool. Now, um, Zoom comes with a free version, but you're limited to only 45 minutes max on the free version. Most people buy the paid version, the next version up, um, and that's around $149 and you have to pay it yearly. One of, I was going to say a drawback, um, but I suppose in some ways is that it's an app. Um, you know, you can run it on iPhone, on Android, on your tablet, um, on your desktop, Mac, PC, Linux. They provide the app on almost all platforms but it is an app and you've got to download it and to have a zoom the other person has to have the app and if you're dealing with somebody that's not particularly technical um, and they're not used to zoom it can be a slight hurdle for app but in all fairness it's one of the more easier apps to utilize the other factor, especially if you're utilising WordPress for your coaching and for your membership site, and I think you should be, um, is that we, you, you can't actually embed the Zoom on your web page native, natively. There are some very popular free plugins that enable you to get around that and to embed the Zoom on your web page. Um, the other factor, um, there's two other factors that you should know about Zoom in tw at the end of 2023. Um, security. Zoom has a history of problems with security and also around the usage and privacy agreement that you sign with Zoom when you actually first download the app and you just click the agreement contract that flashes in front of you. Um, especially if you're in the field of confidential um, coaching around particular sensitive issues, that might be a big no-no why you're not going to utilize Zoom. And it's a factor that you really got to look into and the final thing is that Zoom was pretty easy to set up on a web, to utilize it on a website. If um, using one of these third party plugins, there's one that was particularly popular. I know the developer myself, a great guy. But recently, Zoom changed the way that you initially the hurdles you've got to jump through to utilize a third party plugin on a WordPress website. Um, they've made it much more complicated than it needs to be, in my opinion. Um, it used to be quite easy. Now you've got to go, you've got to read some instructions, and there's about five to six steps. They're quite involved. It's not jet silence, jet science but you do have to go through them and i think that's made the whole experience of utilizing zoom on wordpress a less joyous experience basically now whereby whereby is uh, i think i'm correct in saying it they're based in norway they've been around a, a number of years they're vc backed 
Um, the great advantage of Whereby is its browser base. You do not have to download an app to utilize it. You can utilize it in any modern browser. Um, probably best to use it with Chrome, um, in my opinion, or a Chrome based as a Chrome based engine. But if you're not into browser technology, just utilize Chrome with it. Um, like I say, both come with free accounts. The free account with whereby is pretty good. Their paid version and the next version up is only $69 a year. Um, I, that would be the one I would go with. But you can try the free version and see if you like it. it has a calendar system with it as well. And it has a number of integrations. It won't, the integrations won't compare to Zoom, but they've done a pretty good job. There are also some other solutions out there. There's um, one that we you, we can help you set up, um, which is totally open source. There's a number of those. There's a particular one we at WP Tonic can help you with. Um, but I don't want to go down that path because I want to keep it on topic because I'm notorious about going off going off subject. Um, I think um, whereby is a pretty good solution for a coach for a membership site. Like I say, there's other solutions. Um, I think because, but Zoom is pretty strong as well because everybody knows about it. Its biggest problem is it, it is app. And I think the other thing, especially when it comes to coaching, is the privacy agreement that you sign, where, whereby has a better track record. And I think the privacy, the agreement you sign with them isn't as all-embracing as with Zoom. Hopefully you found this video useful. If you did, ring the bell as it tells YouTube that you like this video. Leave a comment and if you're generous, subscribe to the channel. It really does encourage me to make more of these videos. I see you soon, folks. Bye.